I'm at the marshes. I can't believe I'm here. Finally, this time I'm going to go on a boat on the marshes. Last time I didn't make it and I thought it was going to be too cold. It's not, it's actually gorgeous here. So I thought like in the winter time, it would be somewhere that you couldn't access in the winter, but it's not. It's January and I'm going on a boat. I'm waiting on the boat man here and I just came here. The guards here are making fish. <laughs> fish, fish. Oh, the fish, fish. Oh, the fish, fish. Wow. Just from right here, so they just get the fish right from the marshes here. Oh, what did he say? What, what did he say? He said, my stomach is full of fish. Oh, the stomach is full of fish. Ah, the doctor says it's good. Yeah, yes. A fish a day keeps the doctor away. We say an apple a day keeps the doctor away, but a fish a day keeps the doctor away. Everybody's so friendly. Oh, let me see. What is it? Oh, oh. 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 Very fresh fish. <laughs> okay. Very good, yeah. Very, very, very good. Very, very good, very good. Very good. Oh. You're a good chef. From here, there's a boat there, and there's a captain. So check out these marshes. So the, the reeds here, all these reeds, you know, the ziggurats, the giant ziggurats that you saw um, back in the day. Uh, th this is the, where they would use the reeds to put, you know, where they put like a level of reeds and then bricks. This is where they got the material for the reeds from. We're docked. We're docked in the bay right now. Got some water. Here, right on the side of the Euphrates. I'm trying to compare this to somewhere I've been, but there is nowhere. It doesn't compare to anywhere I've been. Nowhere. <laughs> it's totally unique. This is the Hamar Marsh. They just go in for miles and miles and miles. Unbelievable. It's like never ending. <laughs> Marsh. So this is a traditional uh, marsh house here. Wow. Very authentic. So, you know, if you come here, it's definitely, it's definitely off the beaten path. Look at that. It's not, you know, it's not set up for tourists. You know, like some places like I've been to, like in Bolivia, they have them similar sort of marshy things, but they're all set up for tourists. All right, all right, I think we're getting off now. Here's the boat man. He's getting uh, the wood for the fire. Look where I am. Oh, you can, it's so peaceful here. could listen to that. Listen to nothing. So we just picked up some fish and um, that's what we're gonna have to eat. Abu Haider singing. Oh. oh wow. I think he's putting the fire together here to cook the fish on. I mean, if you want to, you could stay here. I have seen people stay here, but it's cold at night. I imagine it gets freezing at night. But the ground is just, the ground is like, it's almost bouncy with the reeds. These houses are just all made of reeds. It's cooking mess, goof, but it takes like, a, I know that that takes a long time to cook. So meanwhile, I don't know what we're going to do for the next couple of hours. Uh, look at the, the 
the walls here. Oh, like mud. Oh, they're still alive. <laughs> oh, knock, it, knock them out. That is one fresh fish. You want to see this? I've never seen someone cut a fish like this. Whoa, look at that. Wow. Oh, my shadow's in there. What? Mm. Wow, that's some fish to got. Look at that. Wow. على مود هذا غليظ حتى النار تطب منه. There's one fish. Look, it's it's breathing its last breaths. I can't believe it's still moving after that. Look at that. Oh, here's the next one. <laughs> fish number two. Sorry, I'm kind of speechless here because it's a bit mind-boggling. So this is quite a process. You know, they do the fish, then they make the fire, then the fire's got to heat up. So how long does it take to cook a fish? Mm -hmm. 30 minutes. Oh, 30 minutes? I thought it took like hours. I thought it I thought it took hours. Like when I in Baghdad, when somebody ordered a mash goof, you had to call ahead and it took like a, an hour and a half or something, but I thought it took like hours, but this is about half an hour. Look at the fire here. So he's lived all his life here until Saddam drained all the water and then he moved out and then he moved back when the water came back. When the water came back. <laughs> Very surreal situation right now. Sitting in the middle of the Arab marshes here, waiting on my fish to be cooked in this authentic old house. Was this a house? Yeah. Yeah, in this old house. Abu Haida. <laughs> so, super cool place. I don't know if it's like, see there's other houses around here too? But the, the ground is so bouncy. It must get mega hot here in the summer. Can't believe I'm in Iraq. Nobody could. We on the fish. I just asked how long it takes to build one of these places and it, um, three days, a couple of days to bring the materials here and just one day to assemble it all and everybody just lends a helping hand, they don't pay anybody to do it, everybody just chips in and helps to build one of these things because they I think they, they have to move on when the animals eat all the grass, right? So when the animals eat all the grass and there's no grass then they just yeah, probably hundreds of these places all over the all over the marshes. You know, lunch, getting the lunch table. What are all these? Is that traditional to eat with the fish? Leaves? 
What is it? A part? He said, eat this. I don't, I don't know what it is. What is this? Is it like a parsnip? Yeah. Ginger. No, no. Ginger Iraqi. Like a, a parsnip or something. But you eat the fish with all, all these accoutrements. What you find on everything. And these leaves. I don't know what these leaves are. I'm starving. I, I'm not going to be eating the leaves. <laughs> Abu Haider. Tea on the stove. Look at that fish. Look at that. It's all sizzling. Look at it. You see that? Fish and leaves and tea. So you see how, how they cook the fish? When they gut it, they butterfly it. That's the word I was trying to think of. They, they butterfly the... So this fresh reeds down here for the fish. Ta-da! Here comes the fish. Wow. Here we all are sitting here. Everybody's called Ahmed, um, Mohammed, um, Hasim, or Ali. <laughs> Food time. Okay. So the fish is down here. I'll show you in a minute. Bread. And lots of leaves. <laughs> These are uh, Rashad. 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 Um, I've never I've never seen Rashad before. This is daikon and of course bread <laughs> and the fish. But the mask, the fish you eat with your you're supposed to eat it with your hands, right? Yeah, yeah you eat the fish with your hands. But it, yeah, it has giant bones in it, so you have to be careful of the bones. So let's see what it's like. Mm. Only big bones. It's so good. But you have to be careful for the bones. But in some part of it, it's just giant chunks. Mm. Here we all are. We're all having family lunch. <laughs> Look at the meat in there. Okay, I'm going to turn this off now because I'm going to eat. Yes, yes. What's he doing now? Is that for the cats? Is this for the cats? In the cats. Ah. Who are the cats? He gives everything for the cats. He has two wives and 16 children. <laughs> okay, that's lunch over. Now we're going back to the boat. Thank you for lunch, for the fish. Shukran. Shukran. <laughs> Shukran. It was really good. Now we're going back on the boat. It's so authentic. <laughs> and we're off. Here's Abu Haida. Oh, he's so nice. Abu Haider with his two wives. But they live in two different houses. Two different houses. But he spends alternate alternate nights, that's how it is. But the, the wives are very close. It's tradition. And we're off. So that's where we were, just came from. I can't believe you're in the marshes in Iraq. It's crazy. You have to come here. Here. I 
love this. يسرى قصيرا قلت يسرى قصيرا من هو يملى ما من هو يملى لخون حوي ودخل من هو يملى من هو يملى حلو شي تشوف عين والله عين يما ذبت ندنياي ترى من السما للقاع ابويا القاع وتشمت عداي خاف انا اقول حا حا ثانك يو ثانك يو فيري ماتش ذات واز اوسم شكرا اميزين ابو هيدر ثانك يو سو ماتش اهلا وسهلا اه بلس ذات واز سو اهلا وسهلا Welcome, welcome. Thank you. Brilliant. Ah, what an amazing day! That was amazing, and that just top. That just ended it all perfectly. Nice. And now we're off again. Oh, I see. Thank you, Abu Haider. <laughs> Abu Haider, right? Abu Haider. Abu Haider. Thank you so much. So Thank much. you. Shukran. 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 Everything was awesome. Ahlan. Ahlan. Oh, Ahlan. Everybody has to come and do this. Ahlan. It's amazing. Ahlan. Ahlan. That was really, really cool. Really cool.